A big part of the message today from Cuyahoga County's Board of Health is finding a way for workers, even in essential businesses, to stay home. And they say that includes health providers to protect themselves during what doctors here call a critical time. This week is a pivotal week in the Cuyahoga County and the state of Ohio. We have got to act now. Cuyahoga County's medical director heeding her own advice. Today, going public with the fact she and her husband, an emergency room doctor, now living apart in an effort to limit any potential exposure to coronavirus. And I share this personal anecdote to help you understand that this is what we have to do to protect our healthcare workforce and our essential workforce. The health department monitoring the number of doctors and healthcare providers testing positive for COVID-19. Full numbers expected to come out later this week, but sources tell Five Interside investigators at least 35 Cleveland Clinic caregivers have tested positive. A spokeswoman said the hospital isn't releasing the number of infected workers, but said patient care has not been impacted. Metro Health and University hospitals also wouldn't release how many caregivers have been diagnosed there as the number of cases locally soared in the last week. We're still seeing cases grow. We've had a very, very busy week this past week and we anticipate it's going to get busy. We know that our hospitals are going to be stressed. With the area already facing shortages of protective equipment like gloves and masks, health officials calling on doctors to take more steps to protect themselves, including limiting in-person contact with patients and do it soon. I would really ask our partners, especially those in ambulatory and primary care, to please do your absolute best to transition your workforce home. We need you doing telehealth, telemedicine as quickly as possible. Hospitals say they have cut back on a number of procedures, but they say things like MRIs and mammograms can catch life-threatening conditions. They say those may continue if a doctor feels they're necessary. In Parma, I'm 500 side investigator Scott Knoll.